Hey everybody, we want to welcome you to uh, another Kingland Systems Cyclone Game Center. We are going to take you back to 2005 and the famous tornado game. This is Iowa State at number 21, Colorado. And uh, joining us here today from Minneapolis, we have Brett Meyer, Cyclone quarterback. Hi, Brett. How you doing, John? Good, man. How are you? Doing well. Good. Good to have you here. Appreciate you doing this. We also have from uh, his shop in Clive, we've got uh, Brent Curvey. Yes, sir. Hey, Curveball, how you doing, man? I'm good, man. How about yourself? I'm good. All right. And also from Ankeny joining us is Todd Blight. Hey, Todd. How's everybody doing? Good, good. Appreciate all you guys doing this. This is going to be a lot of fun. It looks almost like black and white footage as we roll this here, but we're... <laughs> <laughs> you guys go ahead and set the stage. Yeah, no doubt. You guys set the stage here because, I mean, the tornado happens. There's all this craziness. It's, you guys are in a good role coming into this game. Tell me... Kind of take me to this uh, this night. I mean, we hadn't had much success against Colorado in the past. I think Iowa State for a long time hadn't had much success against them. So this was a game that was kind of circled on the uh, on the schedule, and I think we were fired up and ready to go. And then in the locker room for an extra half hour, forty five minutes, kind of you know kills the momentum a little bit. But uh, you know things worked out, I suppose. This was senior night too, wasn't it? These guys. Yeah, because yeah, because yeah, right. next week was the last regular season yeah. game. So, yeah, I don't, um, I don't. Do you guys remember? I don't know if we were if actually we actually knew that a tornado touched down. Other than other than it was just nope. a weather delay, and we're just kind of in the locker room, like no windows. Yeah, I, I remember you know, weather delay. Can't see anything. They kept yeah. like holding us holding us in the locker room. I do not remember being told that it was ever a tornado. No. Nope. And then you, you, can can tell the, the, you can tell the wind's still blowing pretty hard on this opening kickoff. It, it, you're yeah. seeing, seeing yeah. it, Tony. <laughs> Tony, yeah, Tony had a leg, but I mean, you're kicking it. Tony Jeez. was 37 yeah, was... years old in this game. <laughs> <laughs> There's the defensive lineup. This is a heck of a defense, guys. And, uh, we had some dogs on defense. Yeah, yeah they were good. And, and Brent, this secondary is really good. Yeah, oh. they were. Hicks and Jackson. Not gonna lie, they were probably the best secondary we went against, and we went against them every day in practice. First yeah. CU series, okay. Tim Dobbins comes up big. No surprise. He had a big game. <laughs> no surprise. Yeah, he, was a, he was a large human. Yeah. So now we're gonna set the offensive line up here, and uh, this is Brett Cornbeck. Here's your offensive line, guys, and then uh, we're also gonna see the the skill guys. Was this Brett with Braves or without? <laughs> okay, that makes a difference. I think uh, this is this is pre time Yeah, I didn't have the hang time yet. Let's see you. What do we got? Austin Flynn, a couple catches here early on, guys. What a great yeah. story when Austin moves to receiver and did so well. He yeah, really, he's... he really had a great year. He, he did. He brought he was, a lot uh... of attitude and uh, just smarts to our receiver room. Just being uh, kind of seeing things from a quarterback's point of view. Um, and then also getting in fights about every other play. Uh, yeah. <laughs> he is a great guy to have uh, in the receiver room. Yeah. We put that play in that week. That was just a uh, play action off of our standard inside zone. I think we got like two or three first downs off of it. That was The fact that you remember Ooh. any of this stuff is incredible. Berryman. Yeah, Berryman yeah. got the JB, backfield pretty man. quick. Man, that happened way too many times. He's so fast. Berryman was a freak. Ridiculous. Now tell me the wind isn't blowing. This kicks into the wind. This is a pretty good punter, too. Yeah, they had a good specialist. They had Crosby, too. I remember that. Yeah. 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 15 yard punt. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. Might as well just go for it. <laughs> All right, so for about the uh, first of about 12 uh, times here in this uh, sequence, we're going to see uh, Brett with a throw and, and Todd kind of get lit up as he makes the catch. Yeah, it was kind of a theme, bro. I like to throw, uh, throw me into concussions to about three or four guys. So hey, I'm willing to take that risk with you. Sorry. Yeah, appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. you're, you're, that's a risk you're willing to take? Absolutely. <laughs> now, this is a heck of a ball, though. He kind of shut me down in the hole, uh, made sure I didn't run into the safety. Uh, yeah. One of those ones where you just kind of try, oh, yeah. try and go up and body catch it and make sure you wrap it up before you get hit. Yeah. Now, you guys should have had a touchdown here to Walter Nickel. Mm. Yeah, we had everything to work in there. We finally – they ran like a seven across deal, and the only way they didn't run it is if we were like in, had two tight ends in the game. So everything was perfect. We had the look we wanted, and I don't know. This is 
Mm. This is probably the early stages of replay. Yeah. yeah. So they, they, they just didn't have it dialed in yet. And I mean, that's obviously that's a catch. Yeah, yeah they don't miss been. that in today's game, but. Should have been. But it ends up yeah, Shaggy ends up hitting a field goal for you. My man Shaggy. Does Shaggy, uh, does Shaggy work out in the weight room with the rest of us or no? <laughs> <laughs> hey, just made kicks, man. I don't care what you look like. He made clutch kicks, man. I'll never forget this game. I'll never forget the, uh, yeah. the Iowa game our senior year, Brett. Big Joe. Hey, it's Joe. It's Big Joe. <laughs> it is Joe. Yeah. Oh, Joe it, man. Joe was awesome. She loved that towel. All right, so third down. <laughs> Curveball, you come up big here. Oh, I made one? You made one. This is one of my two plays. I made all night. But I'll take it. And I almost oh, lost. Throw him down, big right, curve. Honestly. You might want to block him. That yeah. left guard. I mean, that happened a lot. For him. It happened a lot. It didn't get blocked, especially in practice. Like Brett. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> What's 66 doing? I don't know. I paid him off. I feel, yeah. I paid him <laughs> off. Let, let, get one. One game. let me get one in. All right, Todd, listen, okay. Throwing with the wind sometimes is just as difficult as it gets with, the wind. Okay? With the wind. <laughs> maybe you, you can get some, I, I, maybe I you can get some separation. Arm. With a 30-mile-an-hour gust, and I outrun your arm. <laughs> maybe if you get some separation. Oh, man. Possession receiver, get out of here. <laughs> hey, trick play, trick play. All we did was we flipped. So we got two tight ends on the right side. So Barkma is essentially a tackle. And they were running cover uh, four, and just, they had no idea what was going that on. That guy, 31, that hit uh, that hit Markma going into the end zone, he's not supposed to be there. I had a job to do on this play, and I busted the route and just wandered into the middle of the field, and the guy almost tackled Markma and ruined the whole thing. So, Mark, <laughs> yeah, gotta work sorry that. about that, buddy. Yeah, he yells at Walter. PA is not happy with Walter Nickel right there. <laughs> yeah, he just didn't want him to screw it up because he was moving towards line of scrimmage, I think, but – yeah, that was good coaching, though, because we had Brant, who's normally right tackle, just flip over to the left side, and then, you know, we're in 12 personnel, so they just think standard 12 personnel. It's coming after a big play, sudden change, and then the P.I., and, yeah, we got him. So. Right back Mark to Mark in your next series. Look at the open field. Had a little juice, made a tackler miss out there. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet feet, Mark. <laughs> back to Austin. Yeah, that's the second time we hit that. Flynn was a standard. machine on those uh, curls and stop routes on the outside. Yeah, we called that like 45 roll stop, or 44 roll stop. All right, Todd, this is the one that sent you to the trainer. Mm. <laughs> you not know, it's crazy. Not the last time that happened. If, th if this isn't like the last, you know, if this is today, you're not coming back in the game. No. Luckily, it was all. 15 years ago and nobody cared about kickers. Yeah, yeah, they didn't. Same thing with Flynn. We'll see later on a kick return where Flynn gets knocked out and comes back in the game just because – they, they didn't have as much as many eyes on it as they do now. Jeez. Oh. Yeah, I'll, I'll give you that one, Todd. That was a nice one. <laughs> Thanks, man. Mike Grant, Mark Coberly checking on you. I uh, love yeah. Coach G, Cobes. Coberly's my guy. He's my guy right there. What's a heck of a play? That? Got some hops? Stay on your feet. <laughs> <laughs> Go score. Here's Stevie. Yeah, Stevie was hurt hey. this game. No, yeah. he had like uh, I know he could. Yeah, he got dinged up. up or Stevie was dinged up. He was he had a groin career, injury. He was a stud. Yeah, there's a chance he wasn't even gonna play. So, I mean, we had like I think we had less than like we had 38 yards rushing. They had like 25. Yeah. So I mean, there was like no on a night when he needed it. Neither team had much of a run game. Now Aaron Brandt thinks he has his first career reception here, <laughs> but. <laughs> Yeah. Hit Corey Pence first. I don't know how I feel about our uh, right tackle with his eyes back on the quarterback watching the ball. <laughs> not screen, he's not touching anybody right now. <laughs> yeah. I got to move and find a, like, you know, Steve and I just got to see each other. If I'm standing right behind a lineman, he's going to stand behind him too. So. <laughs> so it was intended for Corey Pence, though. It's pretty. <laughs> yeah. Dude, Corey. Pretty athletic move by Brant, though. He's, he's a good athlete. He did a good job. I give him that. So into the wind, Culbertson. This is a big kick into the wind. Yeah. And you guys have a thirteen nothing lead. Looks like you're in pretty good shape right here. Yeah, you're feeling good about it, especially with how good our defense is playing. Uh, they're playing downhill all night, and you know, Clatt couldn't really get going. Yeah, it's Joel Clatt. If everybody watching at home is trying to figure out yeah. who that is, yep, that's him. 
I mean, big time now. And right. he has a pretty good throw right here to Quinn Sipniewski. Yeah, that was a good ball. They had some big tight ball. ends. I do remember that. I think they were. Yeah, one. I remember that too. They were, yeah, big tall guys. Yeah. And they really had kind of had a shot to blow him up and I think missed. Yeah. Hugh Charles is going to take it in, cut the lead to 13 7. That's He's it. a good back. Little dude, but he, was, he could fly. He was like the. He, he like couldn't catch Kurt Ray, but he could fly. Like I mean, you know. <laughs> got a little gas behind me. With the, with the assist from Mosier. That was, really, that was hilarious. It's Mason Crosby hitting a field goal. He's yeah. been in the NFL for quite some time. Some days, huh? Yeah. Blanket ship, good punt uh, here into the wind. Yeah. Great kick. That's huge. Yeah. So there guys Blank, yeah. 15 Blank yards. saved us a lot of times. He, he, he had a good year, good couple of years. Big hit, Blank. String it out. There you go. Brent, how good was uh, Tim Dobbins in this game? Man. So I mean, good. he was just a freak in general. And he got to – Coach kind of – I remember Skadena kind of let him run free. Me and Lee's kind of held up the front. It's fun to see Adam Carper run around there, too. He was a stud when he was on yeah, the field. Yeah, he was. Yeah. He was healthy. Hey, Kurt, while you're making another play, see? Ooh, there you go, Kurt. Yeah, Ooh, that's, that's, that's Oh, look at Mosier. Mm, Head coach of the four Dodge Dodgers. Yeah. Right? That's right. Yeah, I love that. Look at the pressure, though. A pretty good hit. Ah, I should have got my head across the front. Would have been that's probably a flat. Hey, that's probably got a flat. That, uh, got that 5'10", 305-pound body fall. Oh, on okay. <laughs> okay. 5'11". I and, hit. and I still got hops. So I, don't, I don't care if it is 5'10". Oh, I know. I remember the first time I saw you uh, playing basketball on the rack when we were freshmen. See oh, you yeah. under six foot, 300 pounds go up and just easily dunk the ball off a drop step. We're like, who is this? This is different in college. I mean, it happens. Another big play by you on fourth and one. And Nick Leaders blew this one up. He did. Yeah, Leaders got good penetration yeah. here. Leaders set me up. The whole thing God, man, look at that. He was so crafty with his hands and his first step. He was. He was nice. Look at Mosier jumping on top of the pile. <laughs> That's it, man. To take all the 11 hats to the ball. Trying to get that Good. assisted tackle in the score sheet. We're into the yeah. third quarter now, and you guys are uh, – blocked one. You guys have the wind in your back, but that one got blocked. So, momentum's kind of starting to shift their way. I think, I think who got his hand in the football. Was it Harris? Yes, it looked like it was third and long. Jamar Buchanan right here. It's a big stop here. Good, Ooh. great tackle. It was. And he was – like horse back there? It looked like he was going to get the – it might have just we stopped, have, I feel like. I don't even remember. I remember. We, might, we might be old enough that we're before horsepower. <laughs> I know. <laughs> hey, I'm glad they, glad they missed it if they did. Crosby, into the win, 42 yeah. yards. Remember when Boom. he kicked one from like 85 yards at fair play? <laughs> <laughs> he made a 57-yarder in this yeah. game, too. <laughs> yeah, he was good. So, tie game. But uh, DeAndre Jackson, special teams are a big deal in this game. They're kicking off into the win. Nice return by DeAndre. Yeah, this is where Flynn gets hurt too. You watch it, boom, right there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he Dre was a really good. Jay was a great kick returner. He was. Jay was, he was really just good was straight. Every didn't mess around, just hit it. Got to it. This is the one. <laughs> if I'm any kind of an athlete, I catch that ball, turn around, and keep running, and I just kind of fall down. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you pushed off here. It's just what I've never pushed <laughs> off in my entire life. No, I don't. Call Except it for right like there. Uh, yeah. Well, just don't extend your arms. You're good. Exactly. You push out below the waist. They're not gonna call that. Yeah. I love how they don't show any incompletions. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great <laughs> money this game. I was on. Yeah, that's a 45 yarder for Shaggy. Shaggy. Shaggy had a leg. Man. Man. Coach Mack. So they're going into the wind in the third quarter, but they're killing some uh, clock on this drive. And Clatt's starting to get a rhythm. Yeah, that again. Oh, no place. So we need a big play in the red zone. This is Dobbins, isn't it? Coming up here? It is. It's a, uh, yeah. Or is this a fumble or is this Dobbins? No, it's just yeah, Dobbins. Run, yeah. 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 yeah, tight end just runs. That's terrible job. He just yeah. runs into him and stops. <laughs> he runs into him. 
Dobbins is 260. He just no, he's just Dobbins. Ain't, yeah, he's not moving. What was the flag here? I don't. I don't remember that. I don't remember. They, don't they moved us back. But is that a Brett Meyer jersey in the crowd? Yeah. You getting any kickback on that with the new legislation coming through? I got a yeah. I got a black calls. jersey right there. Man, I better see that check. Nah. That, uh, was Tyson, hey, that was Tyson Smith. Wasn't <laughs> <laughs> 17th interception of the year for you guys. You guys had a lot of picks. Yeah, I mean, we, were like, yeah. we were like top five in the nation, I think, in turnover. I think you were second behind Miami that year. Yeah. I remember seeing the stat. It's not crazy. Look at the awareness and the athleticism in the pocket. Look at that. But it's called yeah, that. Double move. Yeah. Barkham got called for holding. Oh. But that was a double move. Yeah. Is Flynn hurt again? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he recovered from the first time. Yeah, no doubt. He's still concussed. Like a Barney, a man. Same possession, late third quarter. That's a good throw and catch. That's a heck of a ball right there. That's tough. Yeah, I don't think people always recognize how tough that is put on the outside shoulder. Thanks, it's not like man. I was got any separation on that route. <laughs> Did you record that? For that? Sides? Hey, watch, watch RJ. I, RJ's looking at the sideline of the snap. Oh, my mo. Okay, mo. Okay, mo. Oh, okay, mo. oh hold yeah, on. but he fumbles. Oh, mo. I and they got the ball trying away, to, mo. RJ was trying to make a play. I swear he was outside that play. He was like, he was, he was on the line, and then then he was off, then he was on, then he was looking count. back. Yeah, they showed pressure. And, so they got a big JD, chance here, John but here's Davis the next play. Next play. Let's see. Yeah, this is awesome. I love this. Let's go, greedy. This is one of the coolest plays. Let's go, greedy. Going to. Look at the camera shake. Yeah, I love Mosier yeah. grabs his jersey and rides him all the way up the ramp. He's going to go in the Gilbert. locker room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Because you know you couldn't stop fast for nothing. Concrete. No, not on that concrete. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. God, that was such a big play when they started to have momentum. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was the game in a lot of respects right there. They had a big turnover and next, yeah, next play. Is that Dobbins that knocked it out again? Dobbins stripped yeah. it, yep. Now the Dobbins play. I think it was Joel Platt that missed the tackle off the well, look like you're running from a dog in the street or something. <laughs> <laughs> Back at Oak Cliff. <laughs> Greedy run away, his gold shining in the lights. <laughs> this is a good Colorado team and they're not going away. They're they're a top twenty five team. Trying to win the North with a win here today. And uh, I got to get our guy RJ in there, though. RJ Summer. Richie. My guy, oh, little man. booger. Oh, Richard. Well, it's 23 16 now, so they've kicked a field goal. And here's Berryman. Yeah. <laughs> His clothes are speed was ridiculous. Yeah. yeah, man. Nonstop motor. You get those big hands on you, you're going down, too. Yeah. Hands like a catcher's mitt. Yeah, yeah, it's strong hand. All right, we're going to Barkema here, and uh, and he's going to get lit up, too. <laughs> Come on, Meyer. <laughs> you guys are slow. You guys are fast. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, no, I think this is an MP. Yeah, we kind of improvised here a little bit. He just leak out late on his own? Nah, he was out in the route. That's mm, a good catch. Yeah. yeah, that was a shot. Are he and Milan supposed to be right next to each other? The bargain was the smartest guy we had on our team, so I'm, I'm guessing that he was probably <laughs> right there. <laughs> yeah, we can go into that. A little bit more, but <laughs> no. Bark, Bark, yeah, Bark was a, a he was a coach on the field. He was good. Yeah. Who says Ooh. Brett can't run? Oh, yeah. Get the first down. No, I'm put your head down. down. Get, get your the first down. down. Get a concussion like everybody else. <laughs> yeah, I exactly. Get the first. Come on, man. Everybody, yeah, come on, pick up somebody. Look at See, that. That's what it was. Yuck. <laughs> no moves. <laughs> no moves. Drive stalls yeah. out. You need another big punt from blank <laughs> into the wind. And he comes through. Blank was sneaky MVP on offense this game. It'll take an Iowa State roll. That is a huge break. Down to the 11. They get the field they wanted. Now, you guys mentioned Adam Carper earlier. We're going to see him make a play coming up here. 
He was a stud. I'm still, I'm still mad about how he got hurt, man. He would have been a heck of a player. Oh yeah, hurt horrendous. We never lost to him in high school, though. Damn. Oh, here we go. Oh, we played cart. Good cart, play. way to be home. He was good. He was always around the ball. Yes, he was always, always getting tipped, like tipping balls and stuff. He was really good. Yeah. Our defense, our, that whole defense was so good. But Clack gets a little bit of a rhythm going, and you're only up by seven. And, yeah. you know, it's still 220 to go, still plenty of time. He's going to set up the screen to Hugh Charles here. That screen hit us. I remember this. He stepped yeah. out. Obviously, you remembered it. You played it pretty well. <laughs> a little well, bit. You scored. Second Isn't that your time. second touchdown was on the screen? Yeah. Yeah, yeah right you read there. it back out of it. You know, I mean, but that's part of it. You see it, recognize it. I put it in the memory bank. It won't happen again. You don't yeah. look tired there, Curve, but here, here comes a yeah, play, man. Yeah, it's, it's about to change. <laughs> Real quick. <laughs> <laughs> this I is the play. Ask on the sideline. Can't get burned twice. Three, one hand. I know. Let's go, Mo. Hey, just tackle close him. your eyes. Close. No, nothing, nothing to see. But y'all didn't That's see clean. me move. I moved from the – I think the, the referee – I think he tripped before Moja got right there. there. I, you know, for sure. The referee. Hey, were you thinking about the doing the Baylor again? The Baylor. <laughs> nah, I lost that. You know, Matt got on me after that. And, you know, that Baylor I celebration. Like I've been there, so that was it. I let yeah. it ride. Look like a blue whale breaching out of the ocean. One hundred percent. I give you that. And you looked at the video board though, and you saw you Charles gaining on you. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I knew see, once he moved, once I saw him right coming, a little bit. I slid over just enough, and I was hoping. Mm. Yeah, that's a that play. Was cool. Look at you. I was like, security. Don't get, caught. Don't get caught. Oh, there he is. <laughs> hey, yeah. Nothing else mattered. Yeah, and you can't run the same. You can run the same play in the same series. Yeah, like they must have. It was it. like I mean, it was two plays later at that. Yeah, I mean that, that's you underrated made a great part play. of that play is that that running back Charles is supposed to be a four three guy, and Mosier ran him down. Oh yeah, man, hundred percent. Mosier was a state champ. Yeah, Mosier was Mosier a freaky yeah, yeah. 100 meter. He was like 10 5. He was fast. So, your third did, career did touchdown, break, Brent? Uh, did he break Tim Dwight's 400 oh. hurdles record or something in high school? Yeah. Slads. My last tug right there. Last chance for these guys. Berryman's going to put it away. In the game. He was That's about untouched, there. too. Yeah. Golly. Yeah, once he got his legs under him this year, he was like, it was over. He was money. Yeah, Lee. I wish I could have been out there for those last seconds, but I was so tired. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, nah, I need I need that call, Coach. Let me, let me sit down. Man, we needed that one. Yeah, we did. I'm still tired now. <laughs> Not gonna lie. What was cool about this is you guys, you guys had started 0-3 in the Big 12, and this is your fourth straight win. So you really turned it. Yeah, we started we started off really bad. That's that old Oop Matia. Remember that? Remember the I Oop swear Matia? to God, I was just thinking of that. <laughs> One of the most improved teams in America, man. Oh, my Oop God. Matia. I'll yeah. never forget that. And T-shirts that said Oop Matia. I still got a football that has it on it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, that was fun. I'll never forget it. Yes, you had uh, – you, you actually had started the season three at all. You drilled Iowa. Um, mm-hmm. And you, you beat them twenty three to three when they came in top ten team, but then started conference play on three. But then, what was it that kind of turned it for you guys, Brent? What What, what do you think uh, that kind of got it going for you guys? I think it was a lot of on the defensive side of the ball for sure. It had a lot to do with the seniors because I know Dobbins was a senior, uh, Mosier, um, Greedy, Lamarcus, all of those guys were seniors. And when Dobbins talks, you tend to listen. So <laughs> I kind of remember him getting on us a little to be a little bit more aggressive and we don't have to rely on anybody but ourselves to, to make plays and, uh, you know, get the offense a chance to do what they do on their side. So started with that senior leadership we had, quite honestly. And Brett, you know, I mean, what a, what a crazy night all around. I mean, I mean, it ended up being what, like a 10 hour day for you guys, I'm sure, you know, with the tornado delay and all that. And then, that crowd was just really charged up. It was a fun night, fun night to be in that stadium. 
Yeah, I mean, as a player, you – I mean, night games are great when you get there, but the worst part is just waiting, right? It's it's the whole day. And, like, you know, we, we, we kind of knew what our destiny was. If we were to win this game, we win the next week. And then, you know, obviously the next week we didn't. But, um, yeah, I mean, there was a lot riding on this game, and it was a ton of fun. I mean, for the crowd – you don't always get everybody to come back after weather delay, especially one as serious as this one. It was a packed house before and after. So, yeah, a lot, a lot of anticipation and, and just defense on that night. I mean, Curvey, Dobbins, yeah. Harper, Moser, I mean, everybody, leaders, like everybody across the board played a great game. Todd, I imagine when you're like in the moment, maybe you're not reflecting on everything that's happening as much, but as you watch a game back like this a few years later, it's so pretty cool to see some of that stuff and see, you know, realize you're part of something pretty special. Oh, definitely. It, it's fun to, you know, fire up these old games, uh, get the VCR going and, you know, <laughs> see some of the, the old guys, you know, like Curve and Brett, you know, a lot of our friends, we still stay in touch, but some of those guys, you know, I haven't, I haven't talked to in years. So it's fun to see, see them again, even if it's just on tape and, you know, a game like that, you know, coach Mack always talked about cyclone weather and it could be cyclone weather met. 30 below or at 105 <laughs> or that 70th sunny. It just was whatever that day was. This was yeah. like literally cyclone weather. And the, the stadium just had an energy and a charge to it. Uh, and, you know, we started off a little bit slow. Um, defense kept making plays. Offense was able to, to make some plays when we needed to. And come out on top against a good Colorado ranked Colorado team was uh, obviously exactly what we needed as a team. Oh, that's been awesome. We were watching it with you guys and really appreciate Kingland Systems uh, getting behind uh, Cyclone Athletics and doing this for us. And man, it's been a blast having you guys uh, do this. We'll have to do, we'll have to find another game with you guys because this is too much fun. But uh, yeah, we'll do this every week. Yeah, once yeah. a week, <laughs> you know, same time. Appreciate you guys doing it. Really hey, do. Thanks, man. Thanks for having me. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.